here are the beginnings of the shop project and where it started. Notice the window off to the left and then basically everything loaded up into the shop. So this is a rendering of some ideas that I had before I started the project to give a feel for what the idea was and then also compare it to how it ends up turning out in the end. I would like to welcome you to the shop project because we're doing projects now. We're doing the ceiling in black. We are hosting today a um, end of season party for the hockey team. We're in the championship game. Hopefully there'll be a trophy sitting here. We've got black ceiling and about, we are about 66% of the way done. So I am two gallons in on the black paint side of things. Luckily, I had the foresight to order a third gallon thinking I might need it and I definitely do. Hopefully my calculations are correct, but there's only one way to find out and um, I'm going to be finding out. First weekend in September, we've got red zone going. Until I can free up space down here, I, I need to free this space up so I can get this stuff down and then finish over there. So I started on this wall, looked at a few different heights and stripe um, options. We're going to do a black stripe cross here. Look, I have a helper. <laughs> he made it into the documentary of the shop project. We're, we're taping the floor, right? I decided I'm going to do this in black. The trim down to the floor in black. Put first coat of the black stripe on. Coming along. This is great having help. We're going to check on their progress. Let's see how they're doing. How's it going in here? Good. Yeah? Pain. I got Ooh. a helper. I finally have a helper. All right. I'm taking full advantage, and she's not even on the clock. Oh my goodness. Not Look at these skills. Amazing, beautiful work. We've got our little artistic edition from Sarah. <laughs> we didn't even use a brush until how long ago? Like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I forgot that we had brushes, okay? Yeah, we're using sponges. Using sponges, okay. Yeah. Never use a sponge for brush work. Apparently. Maybe do like a white line, black, and then another white line right here. I don't know. We'll get some input from everybody else. I think I've got it close to how we want it finish it. This has just been a painstaking process of getting these lines done. This wall done is the test sample. I really like the black on the bottom. Paint completed all the way to right here. This has just taken so much time, so much more time than I anticipated. I probably put about three to six hours, five days a week in here. And this is as far as I've got for like, I don't know, at least a month and a half now taking a long time. I moved all these over, which was a lot of effort. The cord's better organized. I was able to find some routing here. So this is nice and clean all the way up to the access point. Same thing down here. And then um, I also weather stripped the garage door um, just to seal it up a lot better. The stripe is getting near, getting near. We gotta do some tape pool footage and see how these lines are looking. Look at this. Wow. That's pretty cool. Oops. That was an accident. I added lights because of course I added lights. I even sneakily managed to fit the computer that runs here into the actual rack so it's nice and hidden off the floor. We've got this wall now white. So we're getting close to the connection. I only have this wall over to the tools. Painted this black all the way to the edge. I have, a, I have a phenomenal idea for more lighting, more LED lighting. I can take this all the way around, connecting the stripe. Um, we've got two coats of green here, gotta do another, maybe a fourth, and we can do the black stripes. Started hanging pictures. I got some of these metal print pictures, which is really cool. I've gotta get the brother race documented to go with this trophy where I beat him the one and only time for the rest of our entire lives that he'll ever get a chance to race me. I got the Chad Reed guy up there. 
and framed, and then I've got various photos up here. I framed my first paycheck, pay stub from Fun Center. This is starting to become finalized. Various parts, like organizational part, get organized and hung up, but I've got all that going. We got the lights. I am placing them on the floor, connecting them. I've got to figure out how to wire them to make sure that they work before I put them up there. Okay, we're all wired up. This is the moment of truth to see if this has been a waste of time. <laughs> Awesome. Okay, I know why those aren't going because I haven't connected all of them down. Yes. Yes. It's also cool that I wired that and it worked. <laughs> and tightened everything up. Look at that. I don't recall when the last update was done, but I got it cleaned and we've got these lights going. Trouble shot. Some of the uh, light blowouts that I had. I've wired up a way to take the spare parts into their own lights, and we're gonna see if I can blow some shit up or make it work, one of the two. Really, the only way to test it is live, so let's see what, what I did. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes, okay. So I can get these going. I'm gonna set these on a controlled timer so that I can turn everything on and off, cause, cause watch this. Alexa, turn off shop. Let's see, everything starts powering down. These I could not do on a smart switch because they they just draw too much power and it blows up any of the smart switches. So we've got a little switch bot guy that controls it. Alexa, turn on shop. Bink. <laughs> it's so cute. So I'm wiring up another one. Then we'll have full animation control. I love it. It's cool. Everything wired up. Alexa, turn on shop. Oh, oh, uh -huh. anything else gonna turn? Oh, yeah, ah, ha, ha. got all my caulk hanging right there. It's all done, I've got lights, paint, organization. I've got this guy hung with my little projects and stuff that I'll need for doing things. We open this garage door. Everything drops down really nicely. All my gear gets displayed. I'm currently working on staining the rock a dark color to kind of match the door. Endless projects, 